for cheap, fast, and reliable coins. Make sure to head on over to my sponsor, buymaddencoins.com. They got quick delivery, 24-7 support, and make sure to use code POOL at checkout for 20% off and an extra 10% coins at checkout. Hey everyone, it's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, and today we got the new power-ups. It's Sunday, and this is the day I've been talking about for about a week and a half, so we're gonna be, I'm going to be pulling some packs, and I'm going to be putting them into the set to see if we can get any new power-ups. Now, I got a list right here on my phone. So we got Philip Lindsay, William Jackson, Zay Jones, DeMonte Casey, Kazi, Jared Cook, Jamie Collins Sr., Mario Addison, Leonard Williams, Nick Foles, Nate Solder, Jawan James, and um, that's it. So those are the new ones we're looking to pull. So those should be going for quite a bit. I'm not sure if there's a coin value on here yet. There's not, but I know they're going to be going for a lot. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be pulling these get a player packs, and I'm going to be trying to get one of them. And if I don't, I'm going to put them right into the silver exchange set, and then I will be trying to get them from there. So you guys, if you guys don't already know this method, that's my video. I have a, two videos on them on this channel already within the last week, so it shouldn't be too hard to find them. I'll probably link them in the outro, to be honest. Now, if you haven't already, go down below, drop the like, comment, and subscribe. Also, when you pull these golds, these golds, um, you could you could sell them or you could toss them into a set. I'll explain that afterwards when I'm done. I'll pull about 10. I have plenty of silver, so I don't really need to be pulling them. Another gold. And remember, these are whenever you get a gold from these packs, you're pretty much already won. So that's it's a pretty good profit right there. You just keep selling. Let's see. You don't usually get the power ups out of these, but these are a good ways to get the silvers and gives you a chance, and you just re-roll them. I'll pull about 10, but I have so many gold, I don't have to be doing this. So the second I get to like around 10-ish, I will head over to the set and I'll be doing it. I wonder which one's going for the most right now. If I had to look and guess, I'd say that Philip Lindsay, Jared Cook, Nick Foles maybe. Maybe because of just the, the, just because they're going to be in a theme team. And then Nick Foles is not, yeah, Nick Foles is probably going to be one for the, for the Eagle Seed team. Oh, they have, no, they have Donovan McNabb. might not be that much of a demand, but I'll do like two more of these. I never got the power ups out of this one. I don't know why. I always get it out of the exchange. Hopefully, I gotta go and we'll make some coins, get back up over a mil, and then go for my new Vic and then Lawrence Taylor. All right, I'll do one more, and then I'll show you guys how this works in a second. And silver. All right, doesn't matter. I have so many silvers; doesn't even matter to me. If you notice, it only cost me five k. So just like notice how many coins that took me. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go over to the exchange set, right? And then you're going to go to players and then the low silver to high silver exchange. So you're gonna put two in. And this is where they just, they, this, this set right here just pumps out power-ups. I mean, obviously you'll go on a streak of like maybe five straight silvers, but then you'll get some power-ups too. So that's a silver, that's a high silver. If you got no power-ups from this, you'd barely, like if I got no power-ups from this, I would lose only 5K. So like, it's not like you lose a lot. And if you pull one power up, you make your money back. If you pull a gold from before I could sell those golds. If I sell those golds for like a total of 2K, I would have only lost about 2K on all this. It's a really good method. Now let's see what I can get. I mean, even last week's would be good. Or like the, the Barkley, probably Barkley probably still goes for some a power up right there. And we get Bob Miller. That's probably a good one actually, because he still has the MVP out. Probably was like 3K. So already I made my money back. That and the gold that made my money back on this whole thing already. I love this method right here. Another power up, and we get Lane Johnson. That one probably doesn't go for too much, probably like 1.5K. But again, we're, we're up now, we're up money. And all you gotta do is just hope you gotta get a new one. If you get a new one, it's it's it's, it's a big hit already. Cause like when State Law, I think it was two weeks ago, Saquon Barkley was going for 70, he was going for like 70K and he was consistently selling. I got the Bobby Jackson, not the ball, what am I saying? The, uh, the, oh my God, the safety on the Cowboys. Jones, Byron, I got Byron Jones, okay, my bad, I got Byron Jones, I sniped him actually for like, okay, and I sold him for 40k, so that was a pretty good snipe, hoping not silvers, um, okay, boys, since you didn't, uh, some people were complaining about me saying in the beginning, so I'll say it mid-video, since like, I feel like we're ready, I'm, I'm still gonna be doing stuff while I'm doing it, so, we're at a thousand and like 50 subs, that is a thousand one hundred fifty subs, that's crazy, I think a week ago, we were still at 300, this is crazy what we're doing right now, and um, like I said, I'm going to Cali next week, so I will be pre-recording a bunch of gameplays with maybe some other YouTubers so I can have them ready for you guys to watch throughout the week, keep you guys busy. Maybe we'll pre-record one sniping filter, and then that'll be about it for the week. You know, with the channel going the way it is, I don't want to kill the momentum, so I'm, I'm going to try to have seven videos out for every seven days in there. I'm going to try to, at least hope so. Hope to do that. All right, it's kind of dry right now. But you guys at the point, it's not a... 
you have to understand that while mine are bad, that's good because that means you guys will probably have good ones. And you really, I really don't lose much. It's all about, oh, there we go, power up. Tremaine Johnson, that's not a new one, right? No, it's not. But you don't lose, you don't lose, you barely lose anything on this method. It's so cheap. And the odds you, like the one, the person that always tells that I talk to about these who doesn't, that guy literally gets them every time. Like if you sit here long enough, you get them. And you way make your money back. And you can still put, the, put these, you could just sell these silvers off. It's very simple. Or go make silver tokens. We could always make silver tokens. And then go put those into sets. Which I will explain right after this. How many silvers I got? I know I have tons of silver. I could literally do this all day. 82. Oh, I'm, I'm, where'd all my silvers go? I'd probably put them into tokens. I forget what I do sometimes with my silvers. I was making a lot of tokens this week for some methods that I have already planned. Like the team of the week when yesterday I had to make some silver tokens there. And some gold tokens. No, I did not have to use silver tokens, actually. I don't know what I used them on. There you go, power up. And we get Emmanuel Sanders. No, that's not a good one. Let me show you, let me just show you the prices so far, right? So I probably in silvers have lost about I probably spent about 10k in silver so far. About 10k in silvers, maybe 12k. So if you look at what we got back so far, and this is I have the worst luck right now. So Emmanuel Sanders goes for 900 coins. So I'm back to like let's go. I spent 12k and 12k. So I'm at 11k about. Tremaine Johnson goes for 700. I'm at about 11 point 10 point three, and then. This is uh, Lane Johnson. Goes for a thousand. Oh, these are down right now. 3K. So 9K, then 7. That's like I'm at about 6K already. That's 6K, and then plus all of these silvers and golds. Let's see about. I'll do it this way 500, 500, 500, 500. So that's 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 4.5, 6, uh, 5,000, 5.5, 6,000. 6.5, 7,000, 7 7.5, and then you can add the gold. The gold's about 800, so 8, 6, 1,600, and then you got 3,200. 3, 3, so I'm up, actually. If you add all that up, I broke about even. So think about it. If you get the worst stuff, you break about even. Like, the, if you really think about it, to get a player pack, every card that you get out of there sells for at least 500 coins. So you could literally just do that all day. You could do, you could open up a hundred of those, literally a hundred of those, and then just resell them if they're not power up. So that's another way to do this. But I personally like this method a lot because I usually get some pretty good stuff out of here. Not this week, obviously, but it's on, remember on video out of the thousands of you that will be doing this, I'm, I'm just one. So obviously the one person probably isn't gonna get the luck. But out of the thousands of you, there's probably gonna be a few people like do. So good luck on that one. It's pretty good. Now, to all you saying, I don't have a lot of coins. Like I've been saying, I use, I spend them. I literally like I'm going for the Odell next. That is why I don't have that many coins. <sighs> okay, so pretty much about it on the method. Um, if you guys want to know what to do with the silvers, because people always ask what to put the silvers and the golds afterwards, I recommend putting them into this area right over here. Look, no, well, there's two things you could do, right? So as far as earning tokens, you could put the golds into here and earn get these tokens here. The gold tokens and then you could go over here to exchange you can you could you could put the high silvers up to low golds but i don't recommend that i don't I, you're better off just selling the low the high, i think you're better off just selling the high silvers just sell them or put them into a silver token now once you make those golds by the way the best set right now in the game that i think is this set right over here i passed it so you would take the you take the high silvers and you can either make them to low golds, but I don't recommend doing these. Sell them, and then you take the golds, you make them into gold tokens, and you want to make this one right here. This is one of the best sets in the game right now. I went over it in yesterday's video. I'll link that in the end too if you guys want. This right here is so like the way I did the math that worked yesterday. It might be a little different now. Everything came out to about like so below 65k when you I messed up the power part. But if you if you put up the if you include the price of the power players, it comes out to about 65k. So that's only gonna be so let's see 65k. And then the, the worst card you can get out of this is 68k. So if you, you lose literally 3k if you get the worst pull. And if you get the best pull, you make almost 100k plus. If you get like one of the 95s. So this is definitely the best set in the game right now. So what you do, I recommend you combine these two. So what you're going to do is you're going to take today's today's method. And you're going to try to get the power-ups. If you don't get the power-ups, you make tokens. You do this set right here. And then you see if you, can, if you can get one of the top team of the week players, you make a lot. If you get one of the middle ones, you make a good amount. And if you get one of the horrible ones, you lose 3k. losing. So for the whole day, imagine you did all these sets. 
and you got all the worst stuff, you lose only a few K. That's little risk. I think little risk is the best way to ever make coins. And there's no, like, what sucks is when you do like, when you do all, you re-roll, right? You could lose all your coins or you can make back all your coins. Like it's, it's too risky for me. I don't like that. I don't like the chance that you could literally lose everything. So this is, this is the one I recommend doing right here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do one more actually before I get out of here. I recommend you guys all try this. Obviously, if it's not working too well for you, just don't do it. You don't want to lose. I mean, it, you can't really lose much. So actually, no, keep doing it. There's not, there's not a way to lose much in this set at all. I would love to pull a new one, though. Those go for a lot of money right now. Power up. And we get Travis Frederick. He needs a new card. Did he get one already? Hope I didn't just misspeak. I, I had his diamond that I've been wanting. I wanted to use it for like the whole year, but I never got a new card for it. Give me one of the new ones. Demario Davis. All right, one more. We're getting power ups right now. The other day, I, on the other video, I was cranking out power. I got Tyree Kill too. I was cranking out a lot of power ups. All right, all right. That's it for the video, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, that's about it. So make sure to go down below, like, comment, subscribe. Also, it's everyone watching. Go over to Twitter. I have a lot of subs on here, but not a lot of people on Twitter. So. Everyone watching this video, the Twitter, the Twitter handle is down below. It's poodle underscore gaming underscore. It will head over to Twitter, hit me up on the DMs, tweet at me. If you need any help, just hit me up. So that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm out. See you later.